Trent Frederick has a milestone game, and the game is on. The two teams starting their fourth lines. Derek Forbert rattles it. Feature to Lauko to Shattenkirk, a good save by Soros, and Sherwood is in transition. Forbert back. Sisson scores a one-timer off Forbert's stick. It teed it up for Sissons, who has his second goal. Activate the D, four-man attack. And you're right, Jack, just that little stick position of Forber was generally a good play. Disrupts that pass attempt, but as it turns out, now it's a perfect... Marshawn is out. Forber, a wall pass. Marshawn, a save by Soros. Didn't have one. Uh, some big plays by the Bruins penalty killing. It started with the child, Charlie Coyle face-off win. It take a lot of that 14 seconds off the clock to Marshawn's penalty. Then the great block. It was a nice play entering the offensive zone. Evangelista to Nyquist behind the back. Novak, Dan Evangelista and Swayman makes a good save. Drifting around, figuring out where to be. He's deep in his own zone. You can see him right there in the replay, circling in the opposite direction. Now he's nowhere near the blue line, so that's a quick re-entry. Good recognition. Evangelista takes that shot. Saka. Clean entry, Van Riemsdyk. Sissons couldn't clear. McAvoy's shot bounces off Fabro's leg. Marshawn to Van Riemsdyk. He scores his first as a Boston Bruin. It's not Six. how. It's not how. It's how many. I think this one winning on Fabro, didn't it? Yep. Side ice. Yeah, he's very good. In and around the net. Scores the majority of his goals from 15 feet or closer. They work the low play. He's looking to make a pass. Cross to the other side of the ice to Pasternak. If that's not there, maybe a touch to Zaka, who's approaching the net. But the Bruins get the good bounce that they needed. Fabro's going down, trying to take away that pass. McAvoy to Grizzly. Frederick gains the line. Geeky trying to feed Frederick. Patra, Geeky. A good depth of net. JVR's alma mater, UNH, beat number one in the nation, BU. <laughs> Sissons out battles Krizlik. Philip Forsberg in front. Grizzlick on the stick. Pasternak has a breakaway, and Soros robs him. Shattenkirk. Grizzlick whistles it just wide of the post. Across the grain glove side. That was his first. And then how about tonight? The same two combined. After some quality penalty killing by Boston, Lucic steps on the ice, finds Pasternak all by himself. Two superstars. Forsberg to Yossi, almost an own goal, and Swayman kicks it out. Barry's shot blocked in the slot, and Swayman robs! Scramble moments, advantage to the power play because you really don't have any structure here. And if that puck squirts through to the offensive team, as it does, good shot blocked in by Carlo. But this one right here to O'Reilly. Well, that's a great read by Swim and big time stop. Yossi maneuvers around Coyle. Nyquist gets it back from Novak. A save by Swayman. Evangelista curls off the boards. Novak's shot is wide and Grizzly clears. That's a big clear by Grizzly because they needed fresh bodies out there. Tomasino closes. The tip by Novak goes into the corner. The puck wiggled on him. Nyquist. McDonough's wrist shot muffled by Swayman. Carrier. Tomasino. Oh, a point blank save by Swayman. Off of Novak, 
on the doorstep as the penalty expires. McDonough can't keep it in. Pasrak! The save by Soros. Pasternak gets a penalty shot. Pasternak, the serpentine route. Scores! You could have hung a handkerchief from the corner of the goal, and it would have had a hole in it. Watch where he puts this puck almost behind him. That is incredible. Oh. Put, a, put it not off his hip, Jack, behind his hip, and then just whips it on the follow through. Tough to read for the goaltender. Is he whipping it my blocker side? Is he going over my glove? Is he going five hole? I got no idea. And he just whistles it. So Yossi. Yossi tees it up. Tip scores. Look like Sissons yep. again. Sissons has put Nashville into a tie. Three yep. goals in two games for Colton Sissons. Uh, not much there, in my opinion. Anyway, good job by Nashville to get the goaltender pulled, maintain possession, move the puck around, show some patience, and finally get the shot that they were looking for, which is the middle of the offensive zone from the blue line with an open man in the slot. Charlie Coyle has played 551 at even strength and 551 at shorthanded strength. An offensive-minded defenseman swings it in front and it rattles to Swayman square to the puck. Not reaching Charlie Coyle. Kyle Coyle got that puck. Gary was already thinking and moving forward. He was already pivoting to go get the puck. To carry a through the slot. Carlo parries away. Carson. Coyle on the tip. And it goes off the apron and into the Nashville bench. Uh, a couple of real good looks. Both players missing the net. The first one was Zaka. The second one's going to be Pasenak. Nice play. There's that little pump fake by Zaka in the bumper. Slides it over. It's a little bit behind Pasenak for the ideal one-timer. That might throw off your aim a little bit. The flex on the shaft of the stick in slow-mo. Huh. McAvoy scores! Puck seemed to change direction, and James Van Riemsdyk has his second. Puck retrieval off a draw. So critical. Pasenak able to reach in, but you got to have that shot. The threat of the shot with a purpose from the top of the umbrella. Well, they try to get McAvoy to use that shot more and more often, continue to add it to your game and allow you to make more plays from that position, particularly on the man advantage. But he had his eyes up. He was looking for a stick. Gains the line. Carlo, a good step up. Lauko with Lucic. Lauko saved by Soros. Nice pass by Lucic again. That backhand sauce given. Right back to Lauko driving to the net. Barry to Yossi. Tyson Barry whips it to Gus Nyquist. Kevin Shattenkirk. Matt Patra can't clear. And it hits the post after leaking through Swayman. Has a stick in there. Forsberg to O'Reilly. Yossi with less than 10. The shot doesn't make it to goal. One timer by Nyquist and the siren sounds. 
34 saves for Jeremy Swayman.